After 30 years of domestic disappointment, the Premier League title win was a weight lifted off of the shoulders of this iconic football club. But whilst the city of Liverpool has enjoyed representing one of the world's best on the pitch, like many others across the globe, it has felt the full effects of COVID-19. But in a northern working class area like this one, people often find a way to make the best of what they've got. Just like artist Paul Curtis, who transformed this into this. So this mural, um, it was for Revillo Properties. So they wanted to do something um, in Anfield at this property to sort of make the area a bit nicer. And obviously with it being so close to Anfield and with the success Liverpool is having at the moment, it seemed obvious to do a Liverpool mural. And luckily Liverpool winning the league this year presented the opportunity to do something related to that. Other players have also been acknowledged by various artists in this city. There's another of Henderson too, sitting opposite teammate Trent Alexander-Arnold. The captain has even been to see it himself. We know how much the Trent one means to Trent, and it's and, and Jordan told us there's a bit of like a rivalry going on. Like whenever they're on the bus into Anfield, Trent's a bit like, mm, look, there's mine. And so Jordan was like, I can't wait to have my own one to show him. But I was like. What if it's rubbish? What if it's, you know what I mean? What if it doesn't look right? So, yeah, that he came down, he absolutely loved it, and uh, yeah, so I could rest easy. Home of the Beatles, alongside two great football clubs, Liverpool is often reliant on tourism. The recent lockdown, though, saw short term stay figures plummet instantly. Revelo Properties are one of many businesses recently affected. They own over 20 places around the area, including the newly decorated Hendo House. Covid was disastrous, particularly for the service accommodation Airbnb type business. Um, all of my bookings cancelled overnight when lockdown hit, um, so that was really bad. But since lockdown has been eased, there's been a massive resurgence in people booking the houses. A lot of people are holidaying uh, within the country now. Um, so yeah, it, it's, it's been it's been very good since lockdown has eased, um, and we put the mural up. Bookings have been taking off. Of course, you can't have a city full of artwork without a picture of the great man himself. This one here, commissioned by the club. We are Liverpool, this means more, it says. But just how much does this iconic institution mean to its people? It's just ingrained in the culture of the city. It's everything. It's, it's, it, it, you can't walk down the streets, you know, particularly at the moment. You know, there's still red and white button up from Liverpool winning the league. You know, it's, it's people in Liverpool shirts, it's people in Everton shirts. The football clubs are at the heart of all the communities. and There's a real sense of pride. Jurgen Klopp said to prepare for a party when things return to normal. For now, this is the closest that fans can get to their idols. The streets of Liverpool may well be a little quieter at the moment, but when they can, the manager, players and fans will well and truly paint this town red. Samashu, TRT World.